Tonight, the Greater Accra Regional Office of the Driver Vehicle and Licensing Authority has targeted to register 2,000 vehicles on the first working day of the year. The regional manager at Takuma Mensa tells TV3 measures have been put in place to ensure efficient and effective vehicle registration. It's the fourth day in the year 2022 and already the Drivers and Vehicle Licensing Authority, that's the DVLA 37, is already full with many car owners trooping in to register their car. When the car comes in, it first comes to this session where the customs officers here would actually inspect the documents of the cars, making sure that it actually coincides with what they have, and then it goes into the inspection room where the DVLA officers take over to inspect the vehicles. This year we are seeing a much faster process according to some people that we've been speaking to. Let's find out why. I started the process that was last year. I did um, the vehicle um, inspection, then um, customs. So I'm, I now came to do payment for my, for my number. So it was, it was okay. Just that now the system has moved from the customs, the pressure moved from the customs to the payment. Compared to 2021, I did registration. This time it's been a bit faster and smooth compared to two years ago. When your car gets to Ghana late last year, you should, everyone likes to wait to do the registration in the new year. So it's just the same. Greater Accra's regional manager, Atakuma Mensa, attributed the effective process to measures put in place by the authority. Most vehicle owners did uh, what we call pre-inspection. They examined their vehicles and then released it last year. That accounted for a yard not getting too choked or congested. One of the things that we've done, which is different from last year, is to create more uh, point of service where customers can go to have uh, their license plates. And then also add up to the number of tellers uh, for payment for cash receipts, which means uh, people will spend fewer times when they visit their banking halls. With the country pushing the digitization agenda, electronic platforms have been made available for payments and registration. The situation was similar in the Ashanti region. They have already inspected the vehicles and done uh, most of the work. What is left is payment and their final processing and issuance of documents. So I can say more than 50% of their job is pre-done. According to the DVLA, the introduction of additional prefix forms part of measures to facilitate the registration process.